Hi everyone, so this is going to be my um, part two of my empties video. Um, before, I did just film it all in one, but it's 17 minutes long, which is too long, um, and it will take ages to upload, so I'm going to do two parts. The first part will be makeup, and the second part will be skin and hair care. And I'm just going to dive in over here and just grab all the random other stuff. So firstly I have a candle and this is the Sweet Macaroon Scented Candle from Bath and Body Works and Rose sent me this on a swap and it smells so nice, it's so sweet and autumny and I just really really like it, it filled up the whole room really quickly, I just really really love it. I'm so sad we don't have Bath and Body Works here. And then here's a candle from Ikea. And I ripped off the label, but I'm pretty sure it was like in vanilla ice cream or something. And I think it was a pound and you got like all of this. But I've got all that left, but the wick's burnt down. Um, so it smells so nice. It just smells like vanilla ice cream. And yeah, it made my whole room smell nice. So next time I go to Ikea, I'll definitely get one of these. Um, I wouldn't say it lasted a long time. I haven't had it for that long, only like... Um, a couple of months and it's run down but that's the price you pay um, do candles all the time so next I have a shampoo and conditioner and this is the Lee Stafford Argan Oil from Morocco Nourishing Shampoo and Conditioner and these are about £14 each which is pricey but I do like Lee Stafford hair treatments so I thought I'd try this um, at first I absolutely loved these like and these bottles have literally lasted me ages they lasted me from my second year of uni and I have now finished uni so they literally last so long obviously I didn't use it every day because I don't wash my hair every day but I do use it about once a week um, the smell's not that great to be honest Lee Stafford um, stuff doesn't smell too great but I really love the packaging because it's all pink um, but towards about here um, on the on the product um, my hair started to hate these and they just got so greasy um, every time I used it so yeah I won't be repurchasing these just because it made my hair greasy but when I was using it these made my hair so soft and shiny and they are really really good so yes thumbs up for those and then I have a hair mask and it's the um, John Frieda Frizzies Miraculous Recovery Intensive Hair Mask and I absolutely love this. It smells so so nice and it's just really thick and creamy. It made my hair so soft and you get like a lot of product in there. Oh and the smell, it just smells beautiful. Definitely, definitely repurchase that without a doubt. It's so so nice. Um and then Sticking on the hair theme, I've used up this Batiste dry shampoo for big and bouncy XXL volumised hair. Um, yeah, I really like this. I would repurchase it. I wouldn't say um, it really did give volume compared to the other dry shampoos, but yeah, I really did like that. Um, and then my last hair product is this Ojon dry recovery hydrating conditioner and it's just a little sample which I got from Boots. It smells like essential oils which isn't something I'd normally go for but overall it was a nice product. It made my hair really soft but just because of the scent I wouldn't um, repurchase that. Um, and now on to kind of skincare things. So I've used up this tea tree foaming facial wash from Superdrug. I really like this. Um, it's just a foam um, and you pump it out and clean your face with it and it's really nice um, I would repurchase this and it's really cheap and along with that I have the tea tree cleanser and toner um, this is my holy grail cleanser and toner I always always repurchase it I've got another one going at the moment when that runs out I will be repurchasing it because it's so good and it's really cheap and it just is really good for the skin and then I have this face cream and it's called B 36 cream um, and it's from Cat's Eye Blends and it's for acne which um, I mentioned this in my acne video which I will link below um, this is so good it really helped clear up my skin and I have another one of these um, but when that goes then I will have to repurchase just because 
it's homemade and it's all natural so you're not putting like chemicals and stuff on your skin um, so if you have acne and you have no other solution then I really recommend checking out patsideblends.co.uk just because it's a miracle and then I have a Tensing Mango Body Wash from Nature Simple Goodness which I got last year for Christmas um, I really like this, it just smells of mangoes and I would put this in my travel bag so when I went away for a weekend somewhere um, I would just use this in like, the hotel or somewhere and I really like that and I got this Out Trigger Body Moisturising Lotion and my cousin got this from Hawaii and she gave me it yeah it was quite nice, nothing special um, and then I have used up well I haven't really used it up but I've half used it up and I can't really get any more up but it's a comfort and crumbs body lotion which again I got in a set for Christmas and um, it smells so good let me smell it mm. I don't know how to describe this scent it smells kind of like cow pole which is a bit weird but yeah I really like that but I can't get any more out and it's just hassle trying to and then I have used up this Dove Pro Age body cream it's just a little sample I really like that definitely repurchased a big size and then I've just used up some face wipes so I have the Witch Naturally Clear um, with hazel extract I've used up two of them these are my favourite face wipes ever but they're a bit more expensive so I only get these sometimes and then I've just used up that Asda Skin System ones, which are okay, they're not the best, but they will do. And I've used up this Indigo Spa Hand and Body Lotion, which smelled really, really good, and I've had this for ages. And the last thing, that was the last thing, and um, I'm just going to mention this um, eyelash curler because it's all broke. And this is from 17, but it's just going in the bin because it doesn't even do anything. <sighs> And that is it. I have. I'm literally covered in products. Sorry, my bra is showing. Um, so that is all my empties for this moment in time. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I do like making these videos just so you can see what I've been using and things I buy. And I hope this helped you if you want to get any of these. And yes, that's all. Um, sorry, it's been so long since I made a video. I've been so ill. Um, for like two weeks um, but yeah I'm better now so I should be making a few more videos more regularly and that is all and I'll see you in my next video goodbye